Wheaton South is the spot for sectionals in two of our area teams, North and Central. Huskies a top 10 team in the state. Along with Central, everyone's chasing the three-time defending champion, Wheaton Co-op. Nico doesn't send a team, just two athletes, but Wes Devini is definitely there to make some noise. He wins the vault outright with a 9.35, also qualifies for state on the pommel horse and rings. Central's Ryan Durkin, a state medal winner last year, doesn't compete in the all-around here, but still is a big night. The H-bar is technically sound with the blind change. An 8.1 is good for third place and gets in the state. Teammate Carl Junquist punches his ticket to Hinsdale Central on the floor. Fifth place with an 8.7, he finishes seventh in the all-around. But back to Durkin, not just a one-trick pony, a giant dislocate back half closes his rings routine. A 9.1 he scores is best in the sectional. He also takes second in the pommel horse. North doesn't have the star power, but rather competes with its all-around depth. Here's Brandon Louise on the floor, part of his fifth place all-around score of 47.5. He awaits an at-large announcement for state. More depth from North is the key. Miko Matz drops an 8.7 on the high bar. That's good for fifth. Then there's the rings and the husky duo of Jacob Deerlin and Udaya Kabi. The former is fifth in the event, the latter is fourth, both scoring in the mid eights. North finishes second as a team. As expected, the Wheaton Co-op takes top billing, headlined by its one-two punch of Ben Sott and Lucas Cooperman. Cooperman is fourth in the pommel horse, and Sott dominates on the P-bars. That's one of three events he wins. Sott wins the all-around, and the Co-op takes first place. I think we're really good as a team. I don't think we have uh, spectacular people uh, like other teams may have, but I, I think we're a team that works hard and fills the spots that we need to. It actually relaxes me a lot and relaxes the other team members because um, our, our scores are, are deep and you know you're going to have a teammate that's going to score well if you don't. And uh, well, it's, it's actually really cool to make that uh, showing in second place because we haven't done that in several years. Uh, we were chasing that since freshman year. This whole team was built from scratch, so it was really cool seeing it come to fruition. I am actually really happy with my win today because the rest of the meet didn't go as I planned, but it's nice to know that I was able to come out on top for something. Right before our event, Coach Reimers takes us out into the hallway and he gives us this great speech about um, what we need to do and how to focus to, on our event, and it just pumps us up and we get into a great mood and we're just ready for the event at that point.